start getting active it's just licking himself because of the mind he's just making himself more beautiful lining up the male that has to go down and other if we come across with the female he must be look more neat and beautiful as we are said from earlier on that if we live here the lions must get up and move this is one of the signs that the lions will be active in less than 30 minutes If you look at these male from uh, Mapoho males, all these uh, males are somewhere f uh, five to six, up to seven years. Age of all, they're not the very, very big male, all, I mean, they're not big, big uh, lines into the area because of the coercion. All of them are six, they can able to push other males up into the area. The some of the beautiful men, men looking male lines into the area where the female they enter into the area they might get interested but this is it's a one of the things that how they get to win the territory is because of um, the all five together so all six together they can really go for anything else around in the area and they can push all the dominant male around in our surrounding But in two years' time, this male will be big and strong, and the male will be a lot more brownish, black in color, and the female will be really, really interested with them a lot more than today. If you look at them, the male is not that much good. If you look at the Mr. T, his man is not that much, he's not in a perfect condition. The female doesn't like that. They look, they like to see. Um, a male lion that have a big man and healthy, that shows the healthiness. Yesterday, uh, the sighting yesterday, but um, it's perfectly applied to today. Uh, that's from Maureen. Yeah, go ahead with the question. Yeah, um, why aren't the lions afraid of the noise? of the tank and the radio. Uh, how far away is the tank from the lions? They don't even seem to hear them. Thank you. Look at the question, look, I mean, come through yesterday, or it could be today, early in the morning. We have seen line yesterday. Yeah. Because of it could be this morning. Maureen, she wants to know, how far is the line from the vehicle? It seems the lions are afraid of the tank and also noise of the radio. Uh, it should be true, but uh, our design of the vehicle, it got uh, a mask at the back. It's one of the things that lions sometimes, when we get to the first point, they might be looking at the, the mask at the back and try to figure out what's going on. And also because I was sitting a little bit in a high point than Peter early in the morning. For the first time when we get there, a lion's, it I'm look like individual coming. So a uh, little bit breaking out the silhouette of the vehicle. So they're really concerned about that. Most of the time, I'm, it looked like I'm, I was standing because I just landed at the back. But since from there, and they get to understand the, uh, the vehicle itself, uh, it was no problem. We're just getting here. Lines are, uh, are more than like 10, 15 meters away from the vehicle. Uh, really, if the line down there, you can't able to hear them because they're a lot more quiet. It's only when they start to vocalize. You can really, really feel like you're very, very close to the vehicle while they're close to the vehicle because they have a strong voice, actually. Look like at the end, that was the tail of the lines. Lines, they use that uh, black tip of the tail to communicate. Mainly when they move into the woodland, into very thick or into very tall grasses. We use tails, especially the youngster. They use to follow the tails, is how they communicate moving into the tall grasses. Look at that mane. That is beautiful.
slowly, slowly, all, um, I mean, each and every male here has looked like licking himself, is to get ready, I believe. They're just preparing themselves to move. I have a question from Kirsty in England. Uh, we're talking about female lions just now. Uh, female lions always seem to roll on their back after mating. Why is this? Is it to ensure fertilization? Thank you, Sue. Question comes from Kirsten from England, if I'm not mistaken. She wants to know why the female lion after mating, she roll on the back. It could be fertilization after mating. Yes, it is. It's a part of uh, mating. Rolling on the back is one of the things that lion, female lion do the most, and that is to ensure after mating that it's, it's really, really, a, I mean, it's one of the things that lions naturally do. It could be because of. Um, when they do that, um, normally it could be fertilization from the female to receive or to... I'm not sure exactly, I won't be lying, but it's, it's natural for the lion to, to do that. It will be part of fertilization, it could be true, but we normally get to see that most of the time. Another question from Kathy. Well, to the Lapanzi. Yes. Uh, do lions get hairballs like domestic cats do? Hairball? It's not like when they cough their head like from licking. They get the uh, hair in their mouth and they just put it down. Okay, copy. Yeah, uh, copy that. Uh, it looks like... The question coming, uh, apology, it's a question coming maybe from Sharon. I haven't copied that clearly. Uh, the lion. Uh, it's Kathy. Thank you. A question coming from Kathy. She wants to know that the lion can really call for her ball. Um, it depends actually what the lion has eat, or actually a cat, or it could be leopard, it could be lions. It's really it, but we tend to see this kind of behavior from hyena into the area. Hyena do that a lot of time. And also lion do that. Sometimes we tend to see lion eating grass or leopard eating grass because of the bo of the hair that it really makes the animals to cough now and then. It can split that out. It can do that. But uh, for the extra information on the question that Kefi, I mean, email us just now. If you look at, uh, you just, I mean, remind me, or talk about the hairball that lion have actually naturally. A lion is a species that uh, have naturally on the vocal box, it have a hairball that called Buziwa, Buziwa stored. It's something that plays in the middle of the vocal box itself and it act like a whole systems. It's how actually the loudness of the lion come from. Travel very far. It stays, it stays inside there. It won't spill it out. But anything that lions eat, as far as high that really can stick on the throat system, you find that the land cup, it really is gonna, I mean, spilled up by eating grass and others. So it really can throw it up. But the hair board that they have literally, it won't get out. It's placed in the middle of the vocal box. It's really, really, um, it's giving more heavy, heavy sound called Bozua stone. I believe Kathy, we 